Hi Toby Tigers, Miss McDonald here. Hopefully you watched the parts of a tape diagram video first. Now let's dive into ex some examples. I'm sorry if it's a little blurry. Mr. Schmidt replaces each of the four wheels on seven cars. I'm going to underline important directions. I think I should underline four wheels, seven cars. How many wheels does he replace? Draw and label a tape diagram. So what I'm trying to find out is how many wheels in all. So in a tape diagram, I always start with what do I know? Well, I know four wheels on a car, so I put a four in a box. Seven cars means I have to do that seven boxes in all. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. So I do four in each one of these seven boxes. Some people draw it all out. Some people realize, oh, I don't have to. I know it's four in all. I'll draw it out just to help you. Okay. Now I need to think about what am I looking for and how many wheels in all would be a bracket for the total and my question mark. I'm trying to find the total thing. That bracket probably could have gone that way a little more. So what I know, what I'm trying to find out. Now I think about what number sentence will help me. I could do 4 plus 4 plus 4 plus 4 plus 4 plus 4. In third grade, I'm going to challenge myself to also think of that as multiplication. 4 times 7. When we learn our 4 song, it'll sound like 4, 8, 12, 16, 20, 24, 28. So 4 times 7 is 28. 28 watts, 28 wheels. That story problem is finished. Let's do another one. Trina makes four bracelets and each Sorry, I had to pause. There was an announcement. So, there are four bracelets and six beads on each and I'm trying to find the total. If I have four bracelets, that's four boxes or four groups, six beads in each, and I'm trying to find the total. What do I know? What am I trying to find out? Now I think about my number sentence. I could do six plus six plus six plus six. I could do 4 times 6. When I learn my 4 song, it sounds like 4, 8, 12, 16, 20, 24. 24 watts, 24 beads. That one is all done. Let's do another one. Fourteen shopping baskets, underline important directions, are stacked equally. That tells me whatever I have in one box, I have to have in another box. In seven piles. How many baskets in each pile? This one asks for an array and a tape diagram. We're just working on tape diagrams right now. So what do I know? I know my total. 14 baskets in all. It's okay to start with the bracket at the top. That's fine. They're stacked in seven piles. Sometimes I get tricked if I think piles of seven or seven piles. Hmm. Seven piles sounds like seven boxes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. What am I trying to find out? Each pile. So I can put a question mark by one box, I can put the question mark in the box, either way. So I need to think about what number sentence this could be. I think it looks like 14 things divided up into seven groups, how many in each group? 
I can flip that to a multiplication sentence if that's easier. What times 7 makes 14? And you might know the answer a lot faster that way. I can also um, count by sevens if I know my seven song. 7, 14. Um, I can test out different numbers and see if I get to 14 on the seventh number. It turns out it's going to be 2. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, if I know my 2 song. So, this turns out to be 2 baskets in each pile. So this is different than the ones we were doing before. I started knowing the total, and I did not know how much were in each group. Let's pull this old one back. Multiplication looks more like this. I know everything in the boxes. I don't know the total. Division looks more like this. I know the big number, and I know how many groups, or I know how many in each group, but I don't know the other part. One more. Olga saves $2 a week to buy a toy car. The car costs $16. How many weeks will it take her to save up? So, $2 a week. That sounds like two in a box. I don't multiply by 16s in third grade, so that seems like my big number, my total. When I have a tape diagram like this where I'm trying to find out how many boxes it will take to get to 16, sometimes you'll see it drawn with these dots of like, well, how many twos will it take to get there? Let's think about our number sentence. I could do this as two times however many groups will get me to 16. I could also do it as 16 divided by 2 is what? I will get my answer either way. A lot of friends prefer this, so let's skip count by 2's until we get to 16. I've got 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 8 boxes. And eight what or eight what's it's not eight boxes. It is eight boxes, but that's not what it's asking. How many weeks will it take her? So eight weeks to buy the toy. So a lot of people don't like this kind where you have to put the dot dot dot, but it's just another way to do your thinking. I will be um, available for any other questions that you have about tape diagrams. I hope this was helpful. Bye-bye.